Hi there, this is Marlene Dinarius here from the Latinum Institute and in this video I'm looking at Riddle and Arnold's copious and critical English to Latin dictionary published in the early 1800s written during the latter end of the 1700s and you can find the Latinum Institute at Patreon. That's the new logo and that's the old logo. The new one, I really have no idea what they had in mind, but that's it at the moment. So the word we're looking at, the key principle word, is destroy. And all the phrases, a number of phrases and uh, idiomatic expressions related to the word destroy. So destroy, perdere, to destroy, to ruin, perdere. Or destruere is to destroy an artificial structure. So something man made. Destruere. But it can also be used in a um, figurative sense. Destruere aliquius fortunam. Demoliri to destroy a firm, solid structure structure for example demoliri tectum demoliri partem muri destruere et demoliri can be put together disicere to destroy by violent separation of its parts for example disicere arcem disicere moenia Disicere munitiones. Disipare, nearly the same as disicere, especially in Cicero, in Cicero, who does not use disicere. Disipare statuam. Disipare turres. Disipare rem familiarem. Disipare reliquias rei publicae in Cicero. Disturbare is to separate violently, so as to disarrange the parts. Disturbare tecta, disturbare opera, disturbare porticum, or together disturbare et disipare. Just give me a moment here because I have to scroll across because I'm looking at a PDF file of this dictionary. It's in very small typeface, uh, the original. I have a copy of it. Um, and uh, it's not that easy to read in the actual original printed text. Um, let's have a look at the next word, which is diruere. Uh, Tecta, muros urbem uh, monumentum. Ewertere, to overthrow, to throw down. Ewertere urbem, ewertere statuam, used in its proper sense. Used in its improper sense, ewertere rem publicam, ewertere virtutem, ewertere amicitiam. Excidere is to destroy by cutting or hewing, that is, to cut with an axe, not necessarily implying total destruction. Excidere urbam, excidere vicos, excidere agrum, excidere exercitum. And we have uh, joined together excidere et evertere as a pair. Excindere to destroy utterly, especially of cities, excindere urbes, excindere numantiam, as an example. And it's not post-classical. Vastare locum. Vastitatem inferre loco. To lay waste to a place. Perverterre, to quite, overthrow. 
pervertere spen, pervertere consilia, pervertere domum, pervertere tecta, pervertere defensione, also pervertere aliquem, to um, corrupt someone. Conchidere, to cut to pieces. For example, conchidere hostes. Also meaning to destroy utterly. Conchidere naves. Conchidere auctoritatem senatus. Or you can say conchidere aliquem. Tollere, tollere, is to remove out of the way. Reskindere, interskindere, dissolvere, and interrompere. All. To remove all. For example, a bridge. Interrompere pontem. Dissolvere pontem. Interskindere pontem. And reskindere pontem. Delere. To destroy utterly. To blot out. Delere urbem. Delere omnia. Delere haec. Delere sepulcrum. Delere edificium. Delere religionem. As examples. Extinguere. To put out a light. But used figuratively to deprive of its power and of its existence. Extinguere potentiam, extinguere spem, extinguere vitae societatem, extinguere aliquies salutem, extinguere et funditus delere, perimere delere, conficere, to put an end to anything, subvertere, to subvert, subvertere imperium, subvertere leges et libertate, consumere, for example, consumere aides, incendio, exercitum fame, consumere exercitum fame, consumere opes, consumere fortunas, and so on, and so forth. To do it by way of something else, consumere opes aliquare, for example, consumere opes ferro, consumere opes flamma. To destroy utterly, funditus destruere, or a or e fundamentis disicere, funditus evertere, abstirpe extinguere. Sterpitus, o radicitus, extrahere. Tollere atque extrahere radicitus. To root up, improperly used of desires, and so on and so forth. Extinguere et funditus delere. Perimere et delere omnino. To annihilate. Perimere, interficere, to destroy life, in other words, to kill. To destroy, in other words, to kill a whole body. Ad internecionem delere, redigere, adducere, caedere. Occidione caedere, occidere. Especially with the sword. Enemies. Intention of destroying. Concilium evertere. Concilium tollere. And so on and so forth. Fire destroys everything. Ignis cuncta disturbat et dissipat. There is nothing that time does not destroy. Nihil est. Quod non conficiat vetustas. 
to destroy all anybody's plans. Aliqui conturbare omnes rationes, o omnia concilia pervertere. To destroy plans, concilia disicere, concilia frangere, concilia corrompere. To destroy hope, spam extinguere, spes corrompere. It is a sad thing to see all one's last hope destroyed. Miserum est nec habere, nec spei quidem extremum. The nervi, when they saw this hope destroyed, nervi, hac spe lapsi, or hac spe de yecti, de hac spe de pulsi, ab hac spe repulsi, etc. To be utterly destroyed, interire. Funditus, or abstur, abstirpe, interire. So, funditus interire, abstirpe interire. Concidere. Auctoritas senatus, as an example. Concidere fides publica. Excindi, of towns, deleri, etc. Consumi totumque deleri. Ad internecionem venire. Ad internecionem perire. To be utterly cut off. Perire. For example, by a plague. The soul and all sensation is destroyed by death. Animi hominum sensusque morte restringuntur. To destroy oneself. Martem sibi consciscere, o necem sibi consciscere, o manus sibi infere. Interficere se is not wrong, but not used. Se ipsum interfecisse, crassum suapte manu interfectum. Se que ipsi interficiunt. So that is that destroy, the entry in destroy in Riddle and Arnold's copious and critical English to Latin dictionary. It's a very good dictionary, although the English it uses is somewhat antiquated. So at times I have to translate not only the Latin, but also the English to render it comprehensible to us in this century, almost 300 years since it was written. Well, actually it is. It's, it's well over 300 years since the work started on composing this great dictionary.